Hello friends, welcome to video tuition. When it comes to UI testing of Android application, a more efficient and reliable approach is to automate testing flow. For automating any application, we first should be able to identify the elements of the application, which in case of Android application is not so straight. In this short video, I am going to tell you how we can identify objects of Android application for UI and automation testing. The solution to inspect elements of Android mobile application is provided by Google Android SDK. Android SDK provides GUI tool to scan and analyze the UI components of an Android application which is named as UI Automator Viewer. You can use the UI Automator Viewer tool to take a snapshot of the foreground UI screen on any Android device that is connected to your development machine. The UI Automator Viewer tool provides a convenient visual interface to inspect the layout hierarchy and view the properties of the individual UI components that are displayed on the test device. So let's get started with UI Automator Viewer. The very first step is to enable developer option in your mobile device. Then connect mobile device to computer making sure USB driver is installed on machine. To make sure your mobile device is recognized by machine, go to command prompt and then type ADB devices which should give you mobile device ID. If device ID is not displayed in command prompt, then either developer option in phone is not enabled or the correct USB driver for mobile is missing or not available on your machine. So you may need to install the USB driver for the mobile. Now the next step is to download Android SDK if you don't have already. Unzip it to your local machine. Under the main Android SDK folder, go to SDK and then Tools folder. You will see a bait file called UI Automator Viewer. Double click it to launch the UI Automator Viewer. When the utility is launched, click the device screenshot button which is available on the top left corner to capture mobile screen for analysis. Once the mobile screen is captured, you can select the object using mouse hover to inspect elements property which is listed in the lower right hand panel. The layout hierarchy is displayed in the upper right hand panel. Please note you need to click on device screenshot button every time your mobile screen changes for analysis as it takes a screenshot of mobile screen and does not change dynamically with respect to your mobile screen. In the end, I would say that this small utility works great for object identification of Android native application and helps creating XPath for Selenium WebDriver automation script. Android UI Automator Viewer has some limitations also. The first one is, as I mentioned before, it works on captured mobile screen instead of active mobile screen. The second one is, for hybrid application where web pages are also embedded, this utility does not provide much support to identify objects. Thanks for watching my video. If you like this video, please click on like button and do share it with your friends and colleagues. You would also like to subscribe to my channel and visit my website whose URL is flashing on screen to get the latest update. Once again, thank you.